So, uh, welcome. Appreciate you being here. Uh, I'm Mark Keemster. I'm the president of Ohio Valley Goodwill Industries. Uh, we've been here in Lublin for, uh, since 1985. What is that, like 30, 38 years? Thanks, math guy Mike. Uh, appreciate that. 38 years in the Lublin community. Uh, we're thrilled to officially reopen our store after several months. Uh, we did a soft opening. It's been welcomed and been great so far, but today uh, we're opening to our, our newly redesigned operations and hopes of doing more of this as we move forward. Uh, certainly happy to be such a part of the, the Loveland community. You'll see and, and of your store, your Loveland store. You'll see when you go in, uh, we've, we've labeled the store. It's your Loveland Goodwill store. And as we go to do this, it's because of the donations you bring and support our, our organization. Ohio Valley Goodwill itself has been uh, around more than 100 years, and most folks still don't understand what we do as an organization or a movement. They're familiar with the logo. Like you see, it's like one of the top 10 most recognized logos in the world. Uh, everybody knows that we run retail stores. Very few people really understand what we do uh, with the donations and such. So the way it works is people from the Loveland community here will donate to the door just down here uh, to your left, my right. Those donations will get processed and put out for sale. We'll sell the items inside our retail store. And then we use those revenues to provide job training, job coaching, employment, and in some cases, even housing for individuals experiencing homelessness, for individuals with disabilities and some of our veterans. Again, for more than 100 years in this community. Obviously, without your support, none of this is possible. So thank you for helping us help you. Thank you so much. Yay. I'd like to take this opportunity to, to acknowledge a few folks who made this possible. Uh, our contractor, Scott Rogers, and his team from Sullivan Commercial, Yay. back here. Uh, Mark Ayers, the owner of the facility. Uh, without Mark and working together and make the deal happen, uh, we wouldn't have been able to, to, to make the improvements and actually have the site and I think that again for Loveland refurbishing recycling and, and uh, reusing a site that uh, that really is a nice building with the work that Mark did we're also now gonna end up with a co-tenant AutoZone uh, that'll be in here sometime this summer so uh, Mark made that happen and we certainly appreciate that thank you great partner uh, Jeff Easton who pulled the, the project together here for Goodwill, our marketing team that added the, the branding that you'll see once you get in, and the TV with all the advertising and all the things that we do. Uh, Nancy Medina. Yay! Woo! Woo! She's the manager here of this amazing team that was able to pull everything together and fill the store, so thank you all. And for our good fortune, uh, I would be remiss if not acknowledging my bosses. That's important, right? Uh, Mr. Bill Courtney, our board chair. And Mr. Joe Walter, the tall guy. So I, I recognize the purpose people are here and they interested or not, um, is to shop. So we want to move along and uh, I'm now honored to introduce the city mayor manager here of Loveland, uh, Mr. Dave Kennedy. And if you'd like to make a few remarks, we'd appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. It's interesting that this is opening at this point in time because the city is getting ready to, we just completed a master plan and we're getting ready to invest between 13 and $15 million in the entire Loveland Madeira Road business corridor. Recently, purchased a building right down the road from here that we're going to be demolishing to access property in the back that we'll be developing. This area and Goodwill are just one of the many cornerstones along this district that I think if you were to fast forward for a couple years from now, you're going to see a significant transformation of this entire business district and you couldn't have picked a better time to invest in this area and, and, and watch it all go around you. So thank you very much. Thanks for your efforts and thanks for being a part of this city. So, so Bill and Joe, you heard what a great idea it was for us to, to be here and invest. That's great. Anyway, we're really excited. We're going to go through the ribbon cutting, and then we'll get folks in the store. On your mark. That's set. Yellow. 
Thank you. 